It's Fred with the BTEC Group, and today we're going to briefly go over how to find your IP address for your IP cameras in the MVMS 7000 application, and how to update those cameras on the MVR to reflect the new IP address. Um, this affects a lot of users that are currently on a dynamic internet service provider, which means that their router or modem is automatically changing IP addresses um, randomly after power storms or power outages or whenever the modem gets switched or exchanged. Um, let's quickly go ahead and get started. So the very first thing we want to do is open up the MVMS 7000 uh, program that's already loaded on your computer. So you want to load up the program. Um, normally a lot of these programs are going to load on the control panel there. You want to look for device management if it's not already open. So you click on device management and you're going to get this screen here. At the bottom of the screen there, it's going to list all the IP addresses of all the devices that are currently on your network. Um, so for example, it's 192.168.1.11. That's our NVR. And I don't have any IP cameras. If I did, they will be listed right underneath below. So you want to make note of the MVR and the IP cameras, the IP address, you know, 192.168.1. whatever number it's currently receiving there. Um, so you go ahead and make note, and then you go ahead and open up your your browser, your Safari or your Firefox or Google Chrome. And at the very top there on the address bar, you're going to go to the IP address of your MVMR. In our example, the MVMR. was at 1.11 at the end. So we're gonna type in here 192.168.1.11. Um, in our example here, since we're internally in an office here, uh, we have to specify a port number, but in your example, you don't have to put the, the last colon 81 there. Uh, once you put in your IP address, you're gonna be at your login screen. You go ahead and log in. You should already have these credentials. And once you log into the MVR, you're going to go over to the configurations tab and you're looking for camera management on the left hand side. So a lot of these options are minimized. If you just click on them, you can get them to extend. So under system here, we have camera management and it lists all the cameras that the current MVR can currently have set up. So you want to go ahead and select the incorrect camera there. Like for example, let's just say camera one was incorrect if the IP address was wrong. So we select that, we click on modify, and we change the IP address to whatever the new number is from the MVMS. You know, in this example, it could be 192.168.1.13 or 15 or 20, whatever that is. And then go ahead and hit OK or apply, and you should be good. From there, you can go ahead and open up your uh, mobile phone and look at your cameras, and they should already show up on the screen. Uh, once more, this is Fred with the BTEC Group, and this has been a quick guide on how to find your new IP address and how to update your MVR to reflect the new IP address for the cameras. Thank you, and have a good day.